851, turn right heading 180. Hey everyone, welcome back to DJ's Aviation. As the saying goes, it's never a dull day or not a busy day within the aviation industry. And since the events of ET302, that saying has certainly been proved. Following the almost countless groundings and pressure on Boeing, the aircraft manufacturer has today finally announced that all 737 MAX 8 and 9 types will indeed be grounded. Boeing released a statement just hours ago in regards to the type. While it is long, I'll read it out in full to ensure that you get the full story. They said, Boeing continues to have full confidence in the safety of the 737 MAX. However, after consultation with the U.S. Federal Aviation Administration, FAA, the U.S. National Transport Safety Board, NTSB, and aviation authorities and its customers around the world, Boeing has determined, out of the abundance of caution and in order to reassure the flying public of the aircraft's safety, to recommend to the FAA the temporary suspension of operations of the entire global fleet of 371 737 MAX aircraft. On behalf of the entire Boeing team, we extend our deepest sympathies to the, to the families and loved ones of those who have lost their lives in these two tragic accidents, said the President, CEO, Chairman of the Boeing Company. We are supporting this proactive step out of an abundance of caution. Safety is a core value at Boeing for as long as we have been building airplanes, and it always will be. There is no greater priority for our company and our industry. We are doing everything we can to understand the cause of the accidents in partnership with the investigators, deploy safety enhancements, and help ensure this does not happen again. Boeing makes this recommendation and supports the decision by the FAA. As expected though, like all things, this decision has not gone down well with those who called for the groundings, with many stating that the MAX product is not safe as Boeing is implying in their statement. However, I am not going to weigh in with my own opinion as I just want to inform you all solely on the facts. Following the decision by Boeing and the FAA to ground the 737 MAX aircraft, multiple airlines that hadn't already grounded the MAXs did announce the grounding. This includes Southwest Airlines, who issued a statement saying, Southwest Airlines is immediately complying with today's FAA requirement for all US airlines to ground the Boeing 737 MAX 8. As a result, we have removed our 34 MAX 8 aircraft from scheduled service. Southwest operates a fleet of more than 750 Boeing 737s and the 34 MAX 8 aircraft account for less than 5% of our daily flights. American Airlines were another airline to issue a statement following the grounding, saying on March the 13th, the Federal Aviation Administration, FAA, grounded all US registered Boeing 737 MAX aircraft, including the 8 and 9 variants, as a precautionary measure. This includes the 24 MAX 8 aircraft in the American Airlines fleet. We are complying with the FAA directive. Both airlines apologized for the inconvenience caused by the groundings, but did ensure that it was for all the right reasons. I just want to say thank you very much to everyone that has followed the developments with me. I look to release a more in-depth video later, but wanted to just get this out for you all as I've received hundreds of messages while I was sleeping, informing me on the news. So thank you very much for that, and thanks for watching. The night Race all of these broken dreams and flight And we'll fly